Twice, a K-pop girl trio recently appeared on The Kelly Clarkson Show. Among other things, they discussed their time in the U.S. and their fans. Kelly Clarkson questioned each participant individually about their favorite aspect of living in the U.S. In response to the latter query, the girls informed Kelly that they enjoyed, among other things, the food, the scenery, and seeing their once fans. Kelly sought the interpreter for assistance because she wanted to correctly pronounce Sayu's name when she asked the same inquiry of Sayu. Kelly Clarkson and Sayu's encounter. She then asked how Sayu wished to pronounce her name. Sayu emphasized that Kelly Clarkson's name should be pronounced Chewy in answer to the latter, and Kelly Clarkson made a charming reply. The responses from Sayu and Kelly to the same have gained widespread attention. When Kelly gushes about Sayu's effortless charm, the audience believes Kelly to be them all. Check out the video of their endearing encounter below. On the Kelly Clarkson show, Weiss, girl band Weiss played their no. One single Moonlight Sunrise during a recent performance on The Kelly Clarkson Show. Twice as Sayu explained the song's significance by claiming that the phrases Moonlight and Sunrise stood for the fluttering sentiments that a person experiences when they are in love. The interviewer and the audience cheered and applauded loudly in response to Tuzu's statement. Kelly Clarkson addressed Weiss's leader Gio and inquired how the group initially came to be. In response to the latter, Gio stated that Weiss was formed due to an audition program called 16, to which Kelly added that she had also participated in an audition program and that they all shared this experience. Kelly then inquired about the Weiss members' favorite activities and destinations in the U.S. The group members later admitted they enjoyed visiting their U.S. admirers and eating tacos rolled corn tortilla chips. Momo, a group participant, then added to the conversation by mentioning how much she enjoyed shopping at supermarkets in the U.S. Kelly asked Diane the same question, and Diane frankly recounted all of the foods she cherished eating in the U.S. The same question was answered by Jeng Yin, who spoke of her passion for the American countryside. Kelly then praised Jeng Yin for her low and sexy voice, saying she loved it.